Thank yep, you, Jerry. We well, today's a fun day. DAP Health is partnering with local restaurants to raise money for the nonprofit. The event is called Dining Out for Life. And joining us live from one of the participating restaurants in Palm Springs is Stephen Hankey from DAP Health. Good morning, Stephen. What are you making for us this morning? Oh, good morning, Thalia. Well, we're making fundraising, of course, all day long. But uh, right now, we are at Carousel Bakery. And, you know, if there's anything that I love more than a locally owned restaurant, it's a locally owned restaurant that's owned by a family. And I'm with Elizabeth Cervantes. Uh, she and her husband, Alberto, own this uh, beautiful bakery. It's uh, near Ramon and El Cielo, near the airport. So if you're out for breakfast this morning for Dining Out for Life, you've got to step in and see all of these amazing pastries that she and her family make for the community. It's just one of over 70 restaurants participating today in Dining Out for Life, which of course raises funds for DAP Health, comprehensive care for the over 10,000 individuals that call DAP Health their health care home. And Elizabeth is going to teach me how to make a cannoli. Is that right? That's right. And you were telling me that you started earlier this morning, you got a head start on this by making what you call these little tortillas that you dipped in uh, chocolate so that we didn't, I didn't have to do that because you didn't trust me with that one? No, I don't. <laughs> <laughs> so, okay, talk to me a little bit about, uh, about what, what do I need to do if I want to make a cannoli? Because I want to make one, I saw them in your uh, glass case. How do I make a beautiful cannoli? Okay, the secret is to fill the cannoli all the way through the shell. Okay. So, and we are going to have the help of the little bag with the tip. Okay. So. And this bag is filled with mascarpone, you said heavy cream, and Thalia chocolate chips. Uh-huh. Yeah. Okay, so it's health food for us. Okay, let's do this. I'm going to do this while holding a mic. So, of course, I get a, I get a two-point uh, lead. What am I doing? You need to put the tip in and start making some pressure. And fill it up the cannoli. Okay, we're going to fill up this cannoli. Okay, I should be able to do this. Oh, doing I'm doing okay. And then I've got to turn it around and do the other side. Yes. Okay, here we go. Okay, this will be better. Now, the great thing about folks that are dining out for life is they don't have to make a mess. They just need to come into a space like uh, Carousel Bakery. They'll make the mess for you. Now, what do we do next? So you need to add the toppings. Okay. So you can do it. Pistachios, okay. or you can do cherries. All right. Look, and then you need to put some um, snow sugar on top. All right. I, I like a lot of cherries. Snow sugar. Okay, you got me at the snow sugar. Here we go. Here we go. Oh, let's do this one too, so it's beautiful. Okay, let's let's hold them up. Let's see how we did. You did good. Perfect. Uh, it is perfect. So we have a new baker. <laughs> okay, I'm going to keep my day job, but, you know, Thalia, I have to tell you, my uh, my father is the one who introduced me to this amazing place, and uh, he uh, came for six weeks every year, and I don't, is there a day that he misses coming here? No, no one. There's not a day, I mean, and this person, I mean, you know, you know, dads, they, uh, they're not easy to please, but he loves coming to this one. So if you, uh, if you're a hard to please person, come here because they're, uh, bakery goods are perfection and the service and the coffee. Now you're going to be breakfast and lunch. Yes. We are going to open a breakfast lunch restaurant very soon. So please stay tuned with us. Yeah. This location, it's a very small location. It's family owned, but they're going to stay in this basic uh, building area right off of Ramon and El Cielo. In about a month or so, they're moving into a much larger location, just three doors down, that's going to offer more indoor seating, a bigger bakery, and they're going to be able to do a much broader menu of lunch and breakfast items. But today, this restaurant is opening soon, and so you can stop in and buy any number of baked goods. Take them to your office, take them to your home, and then this very generous husband and wife team will donate a portion of what you're purchasing right back to our community to fund comprehensive care at DAP Health. I suggest Dahlia, they sell back to Stephen. You. They should sell your cannoli for double and put it on display and make it even extra special. I know. That looks so good. I know, right? Although I would wear gloves. If I was working here full time, of course, they would have had me wear gloves. I should note <laughs> that that uh, this is this is a proper kitchen. So this was just for fun on television. Well, you did a great job. Thank you so much. And we look forward to your next location, Stephen. We're going to make mac and cheese. All right, great. It is now 13 past the hour and still ahead on your morning news.